Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to a brand new Let's Play on Europa Universalis 4 and Puma Universalis, where we're going to be playing Macedonia. Now, I was going to try and save this for a stream, but I've decided that we're going to be doing Persia in the streams coming soon. And I really, 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 really wanted to play Macedon, so um, we're going to play him. Form Alexander's Empire and then complete the missions, pretty much. Now, I've had a look at the missions for this, and... I am very happy with the re what they've done. Because you used to be stuck as a tribal kingdom for years. However, all you have to do now is get these provinces, which isn't actually too problematic. And uh, you become a kingdom. Or a monarchy. And then life gets easy. Uh, easier. You know, keyword there. So, we're going to set up our kingdom. So, first things first. Who wants to ally us? Sparta? No, no, no. Okay. Uh, no. Mm. Oh, wow. Athens is... Uh... Wait, wait, wait. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Sparta's not even rival. Well, I, I will rival them just because, you know, I will rival the people who are rivaling me. Uh, rivaling uh, you will be a little bit smart. Okay, I, only I can only have two rivals. Cool. Okay, let's open all these up and we'll... Uh... Get ourselves. Okay, let's see what alliances we can get. I'll be honest, not really the best. We'll get a. We'll get the Arcani. Uh, and I guess we'll uh, get free extra troops. Uh, we'll start trading immediately in the uh, uh, in the Macedonia trade node, I'd say. And that is uh, our opening move. We do not have much money. Uh, we're going to be playing on four speed just because of, uh, well, we can. Like we don't need to play on free speed. This is a let's play. This is this isn't a let's stream. Okay, who are you and why should I ally with you? Okay. Well, I okay. We're we're now allies. I didn't want to ally you, but okay. Now we don't have any claims on those around us, and as a tribe. We can only do really bad border conquests. Which are not going to be good for us. However, if we get ourselves up to 10,000 men, we get a claim on the Macedonian region. And we get a claim on two regions. The region of Macedon and uh, Christonia. So, okay, it's the areas. So we get Macedonia and there. Which are the two regions we need to, you know, unite ourselves. So what we're going to do is we're going to, well... Probably do a few tribal raid wars and uh, build up some bank. Well, I'd love to praise... Oh, go on, then we'll praise Ares. Uh, so if we attacked you, your friends would help. Ugh. Who are your friends? Oh, your friends are really close as well. What about you? Okay, we may not be able to raid anyone. Uh, I'm going to put my navy into thing and I'm going to not pay for my troops. And by doing this, I'm just going to slowly build myself up to up and past my force limit to 10,000 men. Grab myself a general, get this, and then go back and then we'll uh, well, we'll worry about, you know, uniting Macedon at that point. Yeah, fleet for Macedon, we're going to be waiting for for quite a while. Apparently we could ally you. That would be pointless. Actually, now that I think about it, yeah, allying him was a bad idea as well. Okay, uh, suddenly a lot more people want to ally me, so let's we can be a little. Okay, Sparta, yes, Sparta is going to be our long-term best friend because it's Sparta, and Sparta is a very good ally to have. So we need, uh, yeah, we need thirty-two. We need sixty-four gold. Once we have 64 gold, we can basically pay for our mil uh, the four units and then disband as many as we want. Um, yeah, but other than that, we just need to uh, watch everything because uh, AI has already picked a uh, idea for us. Leadership, which uh, I am going to probably keep just because of if the AI picked it. There's probably a very good reason that I just don't know. Sir's already having a gold nearer. 
we're nowhere near having a golden era as, as much as we wish we could. Yeah. Uh, at this point, this is also the scenario where uh, Midia should get absolutely cock-blocked by uh, Anshin or uh, Persia. So we can, you know, we can hope. But uh, yeah, we just gotta uh, gotta earn another um, forty-five gold. Forty, well, yeah, forty-six. We'll just say forty-five now. Once we earn that forty-five gold, we'll uh, I'll be able to start. Ooh, who's a Linfus? Okay, the, you, the only person with help is the guy next to you. Hmm. We have equal troops, and I don't have a general, and the only general I could have would be my king, and... How bad is he? I mean, he's a 4-4-1. I have no heir. Hey, Sparta, you can't royal marriage because you are a you are a kingdom, but you're not the right type of kingdom. Which is a problem. Yeah, finding people to raid is always a problem. This is why I hate tribal nations, but... Makedon is different. Makedon is a badass country in general. So I could do a tribal raid on you. I'd smash that out. Okay, you know what? Let's try this. How bad is my king? 213 ain't too bad, actually. Okay, let's uh pay for my men. I'll take, uh... Oh, wow. Yeah, near enough a month. Okay. So we're going to do a tribal raid and then we'll take the money from both of them. Two, one, and I got a two. Okay, so we both got... Okay. They did just get the... Pretty much all of the morale back. That's okay. We'll, uh... Come here. Stop running away. Okay. There we go. There we go. Okay, so the whole point of this war is just to take all the gold they have. We'll also be, obviously, sieging them down, which, you know, we'll get as a uh, loot. So, yeah. This is a, that's a good first step. I'd much rather conquer up here first, you know, conquer uh, to our side and then down. But uh, my goal in the first few parts is just to get to the kingdom. Now, I'm I'm going to be straight up. Uh, there may be save scumming because, uh, and by save scumming, I will, I, what I mean is, if we fail, we will try and use previous saves, and if previous saves, pre previous saves don't work, you know, aren't uh, recent, aren't good enough, we will restart. That's what I mean by saves coming. We're not gonna, you know, be like, oh, I'm not happy with that, and I will reload. No, no. I have to, I have to say that because, you know, in, this is like a, it's not exactly considered a hard campaign, but it's a, I'm also just going to make sure you, you guys uh, know I'm being honest with you in the sense of, you know, we're, we're going, what we're going to do. All right, I declared war on you. Let's, uh, it's this asshole I didn't declare war on. Uh, I want all you got. Oh, you have, you can give me 10 gold and war reps. Oh, I can make you a vassal. Hmm, I didn't realize you could make vassals with this treat, uh, this piece. Okay. Vassal, five aggressive expansion. I'll take all your money. And you're not... Over, you're not so pissed with me that you know you don't want me to. Oh wow, that's okay. Let's make sure one of our diplomats is always on the own so own subject countries. I wasn't expecting to have a vassal at all. I could come out of this with two vassals. I do have to make them non-autonomous, but. Uh... I think we're about to have two vassals. Uh, let's uh, take in one of these Doric Hoplites and go send them over to the siege. Uh, where the fuck are you going, boy? No, you're just for some reason going over here. 
Okay, you have Macedonian hot plates light. We have Macedonian hot plot. Oh, sorry, Mas Ma Mas Ma Macedonian phalangists light. We have the true phalangists. It's beautiful. Okay, yeah, I knew. I knew there was a. I was about to say, yeah, please don't do that to me, game. Okay, we've. Uh... Wow, two vassals. That's. I'm not gonna lie. Did not expect to uh, grow by two provinces so quickly. And to immediately appease them. That's just... All I have to do now is have good relations with them. And we oh, do not send gifts. We need to build up our army. So I'm going to very realistically actually give myself a... Uh, a new hoplite. And then we'll wait. So. First war. Successful. Like very successful to be honest. That's. I don't know. I I'm actually. I wasn't expecting that. Like either I'm getting better at this game. And I don't realize it. Or that was just a genius stroke by me right there. It legitimately could be any of them. <laughs> Um, but yeah, let's uh, see what we can do. Yeah, we're going to have to do a lot more converting in this one and the clans. Uh, don't really give a shit about the clans. Let's just, let's be honest. Hey, let's go for Cassandra. Cassandra sounds like a great name. Yeah, once these guys have... Uh, oh, yeah, we'll, you know, we'll improve relations with both of them for now because I don't intend to go to war with anyone just yet. Uh, all we have to do is have equal to 10,000 men and we'll get the ability to grow our uh, war. Oh, sorry, grow our... Uh, we'll, we'll have the ability to go to war, sorry. So, well, my aggressive expansion's already really low. No one actually gave a rat's ass that I conquered anything. That's that's great. I like the, how the guy I conquered doesn't even care. He's like, eh, we're over it. Once the medium autonomy, I'm, I'm, I'll be happy with that. Athen, Athens just, you know, insulted me. That's fine. Um, okay, it can be... Or it's non-tributary subject. So I don't even have to own this land directly. Which means we've already made progress of two provinces. Which means we've only got one, two, three, four, five left. Okay. This may happen very quickly for us. Uh, so let's go for... Let's get, my, let's get that 10k men. And we're going to immediately attack when we get the 10k men. Uh, adopt the Greek alphabet. Indeed. Wait, do we not even have writing? Oh my god, we don't even have writing. Well, as far as I'm concerned, dealing with uh, forming the kingdom of Macedon is most important. To unite the uh, to unite the Macedons and establish a united kingdom, we must need build an army. And now we have claims on everything we need to take. Uh, so you will get me at all with who? That guy and that guy. That's fine. Pay for our army. We are over our force limits, but that, that's okay. Hi. No, no, no. Attack. Both attack. Yeah, just stay as one unit. Okay, let's get rid of these idiots. And I may have just got a home run. And not only did may I, I did. Uh, we could raise war... You know, we'll raise war taxes. We don't have any rebellions. I just lost ability by accident. Let's give ourselves some stability back. It's okay. Okay, so we're going to drop... Uh, you know, we're not going to drop any troops yet. So in this war, I would like to take 
all three of those provinces directly. We already have two vassals. Um, do they have any claims? No, that's okay. So it's 16 directly from you, and it's currently 12. So it's currently 6 for that from you. How much is it from you? 6. Okay, so it may just be... We may have to... We, it may be a good idea to separate piece. We'll see. But this is a very, very uh, jam-packed first part, which is uh, pretty good. Like, you know, that's useful. I've just realized that our uh, general's in this army. Uh, you. Let's do a... Uh, do a muck swap, because they actually have some siege pips. So, it'd be exactly 16 from you, and it'd be 6... Okay, so yeah, just piece them out immediately. Take all the gold. Let's get the cord, but... Uh, yeah, this is where we're going to start feeling a little bit uh, bad, because we're going to start getting some aggressive expansion. But it's okay, once I've united Macedon, I intend to slow down a little for a little bit. Because uh, my early goal is just to get Macedon. Once we have Macedon... And once I'm a kingdom, I'm going to feel a lot better. Um, all I want from you is uh, all of your money. Get rid of that. Give me war reps. And all we must needs do now is wait for this siege to be over. And there we go. Macedonia is already much, much greater than it was at the beginning. You can apparently have eight units as well. Uh, I'm going to ditch one hoplite and one of you. Just to make sure we're making money. We will have some rebellions, but that'll be okay. Okay. Very soon we'll be able to make these guys non-autonomous. Oh, sorry, half-autonomous. Let's start improving relations with you again. We will prepare a war with you. You do have some bigger allies, so you're going to be a little bit of a pain, but uh, I think we'll be fine. I think we'll be just fine. For the most part, though, we are actually having an unprecedentedly good start. Like, holy shit, I'm, I'm very happy with how our start has gone. Uh, I kind of want to break this alliance because it's not needed anymore. So you know what, we're going to break that alliance because, well, I, I need the space. I'll make these guys half autonomous. There we go. One half autonomous vassal. All we need to do now is make this guy half autonomous. And uh, we will be sorted. Okay. Yeah, Sparta's going to be our big bad buddy for a long time, hopefully. And we've got a uh, two-year truce with you. So you would get me at war. Okay, yeah, you are a big war. If yeah, we're getting a, spa a favor with Sparta every one year now. Cool. And uh, we can now embrace writing, which is uh, going to cheap. Yeah, that's just good. Give me. Everything is coming up Macedon right now. I just need to somehow figure out how to take that one province from them. And we'll get united Macedon. And we'll go... We're, we'll we'll stay as a minor state apparently. Uh, we'll enact the strategic government and we'll get a claim on a lot larger region. To be fair, people yeah, there's like some people with minus twenty, but even then they're not too upset with us. Like they're upset, but they're not upset upset. So it's definitely we're we're okay is what I'm trying to say. If we had a va if we had the tax and vassal dude, I would be hiring him definitely. Uh, let's turn our army off so we can get some money coming in because we are going to eventually need to start building. You know, like get some temples to start making some uh, cha ching. Yeah, hopefully uh, Midia is destroyed by. Okay, 
Anshan Invasion of Midia. Midia seems to be winning that one pretty handily. But unfortunately, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to have to end the first part of the Land of Alexander playthrough, which is what the official name of the Let's Play is going to be, you know, named after Alexander. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, please do leave a comment, subscribe, do all of that fun stuff. I'm only ever going to ask once. I don't like asking often, really. I don't even know why I did. But, but any of the links in my Twitch, my Discord, and uh, my... Uh, yeah, all my links, my Twitch and YouTube and Discord are down below. And uh, see you guys in the next one. See you guys then.